Hello and welcome back to the next episode of Genoa into the Roman Empire. Now, if you want to be strict, you could say we already have that achieved because we are the Empire of Romania, which is basically the same. Uh, which also was called the Latin Empire because we are Catholic and took over Constantinople here. However, the most important thing here is we want to reform the proper Roman Empire is going to be the goal of this campaign um, yeah in fact I want to speed up a bit our progress here because I have been quite busy in the well work for the upcoming beta and doing some economy stuff which I had to look I wanted to look into but also of course as we are getting closer and closer I want to finish up a campaign to be ready to start a new run as soon as we are in beta officially and that's of course going to be interesting now and um, last episode the developments we had of course was the Crimean problem here we also solved or attacked into France here but also we want to attack into Aragon rather Castile here we could in fact already attack them here but we don't even have a single war goal uh, do we have a war goal against Aragon here no we don't of course we don't now, can we vassalize Mallorca by now? Yes, we can. Nice. So let's do it. There we go. And now we do, in fact, get a reconquest war goal, war goal against Aragon. That's something I am really lo looking forward to. The other thing I want to solve before we really dive too deep um, Calabria, do we want to call it? No. Do we need to do some ideas here? No, I know that I want to do reforms to get military up, however I am lacking the bureaucratic influence currently. And do I want to... And we need formal structure still. And our state which is going to drink, dr uh, shrink dramatically, dramatically when we took over Bulgaria here. Another thing we could take over is Greece, of course, which is also very soon. If we can start the integration, let's check Maria, in fact. Yeah, we can start on Maria now. Hmm. Maybe we want to do a bit of a peaceful time. I know that seems strange, but let's recall this one here. We could start the integration on Maria here. And we could in three years start the integration of Greece here. And we could in fact take the course for Greece back. And for the moment just sit back and relax a bit and go after Serbia of course as soon as our truth expires in four years here. We also want to integrate the knights by now because they, let's roughly say they don't really have many properties left in, in Europe here. So we are only making 0 0.1 so that's basically not worth keeping anymore. Of course we want to continue making claims on Naples because that would be something we could go after. We have two claims currently. The next one would cost how much? 56 already. Yeah, we could definitely shredder them. Ah yeah, they rule over England. Yeah, there was something that was happening. However, we don't care. If we just crush them on the mainland here and take the provinces and we, t we only need like 20, 30 war goal, uh, war score to take what we want and we have Naples itself and we have Nizza as claims. Therefore let's just build up the spy network here, continue it and then might be fine. Okay, Maria here. Let's in fact invest a little bit of cash into you. There we go. And we could also start the integration of you. Oh no, we can't. 
Ah, it's because they are in order. Yeah, they are in order. One thing we could do to speed up the integration, in fact, is how much would it cost us to take Peonia? 24. Because we could return this one to Greece here. This one too. And let's. Hmm. How's Constantinople looking here? Still no progress. Yeah, it basically froze, so it's basically bugged here. Is there anything we can do up here? No. Let's try it down here. And see what happens. Hmm. Ah, we get a new ruler. Nice. That's useful. It's going to be very useful because now we can pick a new alignment. Oh boy. Oh boy. They are bad. Begin a new alignment. We are going with the bureaucrats here. And now we can... Who is a bureaucrat? Do we have anyone else? No. We have to take the Master of Mint here. And we have to take the Collector. And we are going to take the Quartermaster here. And we can promote all of them. There we go. Now let's see what kind of trade we are going to get here. Let's see. Wow. Brilliant. Uh, can you maybe... No, oh, here are too crap to even risk it. Mm. No. Oh, you're at war with Gamion. Would be a shame if we jump on you for Bolu. Wouldn't it? Yeah, let's fact prepare that. Go to Ismit, move our fleet in position here, and let's solve the Greek cause. Now, what else can we do? In fact, now we should have enough influence here. Huh? Yes, 30. No, wait, what? Still 30 on the aristocrats here. Oh boy. But it should go up now because basically all influence is going into bureaucracy. And we should get to 30 relatively soon. And then we can do some reforms which are urgently, we urgently require them. Okay, now in fact, let's do the Bodo conquest here. We are not going to call... So we are not going to make Karaman a main war enemy here. We just want to take Bolu out and then be happy with it. So let's just do it here. And that should be relatively fixed. Sorry, I think that was very German of me. Really quick. <laughs> uh, medium looting is fine. I think we are just going to take Bolu and then we are going to defeat the armies because that's in our interest of the second war against Karaman, which we are going to start in a sec. I mean, in fact, we could go after Mentis immediately. Huh? Ah, but Karaman has to be called in. Okay, Bolu is over already. And now let's hunt armies here. Most likely they are going to run in a sec as soon as they smell smell me coming here yeah there we go and bye 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 that's nothing you want to fight in fact is it already over yes we can already peace out therefore let's do it we are going to give you to greece now we want to get rid of the caraman alliance with kandar if we can not yet, but maybe soon. There we go. Almost already. Mm. Where can we go? 
Ooh, there's another core ore. I bet it's from Karim and we're going to take it in the next war. So, let's prepare for it, in fact. 54. Okay, in Attica, did anything happen here? I don't know. Let's do it again. Thirteen percent. Okay, Bulgaria is out and in our realm now. Very, very good. Of course, that puts us a lot higher, and we are going to make course of North Bulgaria. Oh, that was Calabria. <sighs> ah, whatever. Let's call it now. This one we are not going to do. Dobrogea, yes. Provence, no. Uh, let's do it by hand here. Uh, who else is missing? Oh, that was it. Okay. And... Let's just send some missionaries out. Hopefully it helps a bit at least. Influential bureaucrats has run out. Okay, can we peace? Ah, one year tick. Let's wait for that first and then we can continue. Okay, yes, peace, nice. And we are going to take whatever we can on top. There we go. And now let's get into position here for Caraman itself. Oh, in fact, we I think we maxed out on Papal Influence, so <laughs> that's something we have to solve. Also, we got one ship from Bulgaria. Nice. And also, our economy should recalculate a lot of stuff here now, because we took a lot of stuff in. Yes, we got a new merchant. Is that helpful though? I don't know. We are going to put him... Oh yeah, we can now. Let's trade first with Iran here. There we go. Perfect. We have Croatian rebels in Ragusa. Interesting. I'm not sure if I care currently. Can probably wait. Okay, Greece. How about I want you to integrate soon? And how can we speed you up here? Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, so we're on Yoko. We are also going to do. Oh, we're already influencing them. Fine. <laughs> now, if we were to intake Matisse now. Why do we have a truce? We don't have a truce. I don't have a truce with you. Seriously, game. Okay, the game tricked us, so I cannot go after Mentees here. And I probably can also not go after AD now. No, it's also. Okay, if I would have known that, I would have played this differently, of course. Do we want to purge the Ottomans from the map though? Two Turkish provinces here in the Marmara region. Do we still have the... No, we don't have the Ed Edict N. Learning, commerce, elite loyalty, established missionaries. Hmm. No. But how is Constantinople looking, in fact? Well, wait a second. Ooh, the capital decayed here. That's a problem. Let's rebuild it. Capital, capital one. Yes, 280. There we go. Fine. Um. <clears throat> Uh, 
I'm tempted to give these two provinces to Ro to Greece. Just for the purpose of getting rid of the Ottomans for once and forever. However, I don't know how much it would cost us doing so, but we can just try. Show superiority here and we are just going to go after them and fix some stuff up here. Medium looting. And okay, the other ones are sieging this one already, so we can just siege the capital and get out of it again. Give it to Greece and as soon as we can we peace out. 15 aggressive expansion. Yeah, the normal people, which we already know, don't like it, but it's fine. Okay, we could also go after Crimea, which is allied to Shivan and war with Muscovy. However, these provinces there will not feed, give us a big purpose here. Or they won't serve as well. Let's put it like that. Okay, we have to go after Caraman in 47 years. Which means we can in fact check back 39. Yeah, let's let's just wait out the truth with Serbia here. Then finish off Serbia and then continue into other things. Or do we want to do a quick war against against Naples here? Venice will not join them because they are bankrupt. That's interesting. And they do have 60,000 troops. We have 51 with, with Hungary a lot more. In fact... Yeah, let's move our fleet to here and our army first then we take Nizza then we sail back and then we take Naples and then we just take it over we have Croatian rebels here that's a little bit annoying can we maybe now oh, they already converted here hmm. is there anything we can do probably not In fact, I don't want to care about the... And... Going to organize the missionaries. Oh, I have to pick provinces first. So let's pick... All own provinces. Organize the missionaries, convert to 50% here and send all of them. If it's broken, it's broken and we don't care anymore, but... And yes, perfect. Yeah, let's also take this one and let's do one investment into papal influence to become the next pope. Okay. In fact, what can we do? Eastern Serbia is still something we can up here. Perfect. Maria annexation is running and Greece should follow suit soon. Yeah, 3.6 again because we added some stuff to it. That's fine. Okay. I do think I want to declare war and I want to declare Nizza as the main war goal here and then... That should be fine. And we don't need that much Wasco to take, take like two or three provinces. I'm considering currently if we want to do... If we want, for example, to take a province on the east side of Italy here, like Ancona, for example. Because then we can make claims, for example, into Venice here, which got annexed by Padua. But for example, we could vassalize Venice here, 
even though they are going to hate us big time. And then feed them back Venice and Tavi, so could be a very interesting option. So let's in fact do let's in fact do a spy network here. And then we can call recall our agent from Greece. Poland doesn't like us anymore. Fine though. Now let's move the fleet out. Go to Naples and have some fun with them. Take Nizza, call in Hungary. There we go. And let's take it. Perfect. Light looting in this case, I don't want to pillage these provinces which we are taking too much. Okay. Support for independence, Castile, yes, fine. And now we are going to move our fleet to Messina here with our army. And then we go after Naples here. It might be that England is coming from mainland France to hunt us. Well, that would be fine. We want Nizza itself and we want Naples itself 30 Oof. Oof. Tunis declared reconquest on Castile fine though We don't necessarily have to take Naples in this war Well, it would be fine Of course, we could also go after these provinces up here There we go Time to move out here and move the fleet into position. In fact, can we hunt some Naples ships here? Yes, this one gone. Can we hunt you here? Yes, there's a big battle now. And we won. And now we are going back to locate the main ports here. Leech has arrived. Naples is moving towards Nizza most likely. There we go. How much do we want? Could we even take Ancona, for example, and not take Naples? Yes, but they don't. <laughs> the aggressive expansion in this game is going to drive us crazy here. Maybe we can take this one and be not too bad off. So let's siege down Naples here. Even though they're going to take our war goal. Hmm. Could we do it this way? Yes, we definitely can, but is that the price we want to pay? 17. Okay, aristocrats losing inf influence, that's really, really good. After the war, we can check if we can reform. That would be, in fact, really, really great. And Fermo is probably the better province to take than Ancona, just because of the aggressive expansion. It's going to be expensive anyway. I wish we had a CB which could take care of this here, but we don't. If he would be playing the Eastern Roman Empire, he would have the Reconquest CB for all the Roman territory, which is of course massive. However, we don't. Yeah, there goes the war goal again. Come on. Siege Naples down. Also, we have to take care of rebels in Ragusa any second now. Annoying. However, expected. <clears throat> Come on. Five percent, six, seven percent chance per month to 
have an uprising there. Come on, Naples fall, please. I need to get into these provinces. I don't want to get looted too hard here. There we go, but we are going to loot Naples. Oh. So now we are going to take the main part of our army on ship to Lengadok, or how it's called. And hopefully we can stop the siege before it's happen happening here. There we go, nice. And you are moving to Nizza now. You are taking the remaining army here and go to Ragusa. Oh, we shouldn't fight there, but, but yeah, that happens already. And we're going to take our re relatively useless king to hopefully defy fight the rebellion there. Another war score here from a fight, very nice. Oh, that's not good, but fine. Come on, defeat it faster. There we go. And now we can ship the army to the rest of our stuff here. Ah, it's still from France here. Um, <laughs> what? I didn't see them coming. But fine. We should have enough in some seconds here. Nizza is done. Not enough. Seriously. Okay, what do we do? First rebels or first Naples army? Let's do first Naples army here. And then immediately move over here. There we go. Now we need to land in Girocasto. 17% minus one. All good. Oh, now bureaucrats take over. Nice. We can move our army here. Land movement is blocked by hostile four. What? There we go. Whatever the game was trying to tell me. We are going to take these. Uh, we can't. Why? Ah, because we lost the blockade bonus there. Uh, yeah, whatever. And you are going here first. And now we are going back to blockading. And then the war should be over. Yes, there we go. And we got two provinces. Nice. We are going to... Ooh, that's expensive, in fact. It's part of Liguria. Okay, that's why. And you are moving here. I'm also going to, of course, call you. Now, we do have new stuff we can claim from Naples here. Let's claim Ancona, in fact. There we go. And let's clean up in the Balkans here. And our truce with Serbia should expire. And yeah, there we go. So let's finish the house cleaning in Serbia here. And then the Balkans more or less are done. Naples put us as a rival again. Fine though. Let's put the fleet here. We have also have to pick a new... Yes, please. Recall. All looking very good. They are already running away here. Uh, Nizza, no, decline. Not going to give that back to the Empire here. Now, 
we want to take, of course, everything. More or less, at least. So, let's get immediately started here. And... Let's go for the capital first here. There's <clears throat> a rebellion upcoming in the French parts, which we have to fight. Oh, I wanted to do reforms in between. Well, let's finish Serbia first. In fact, let's check how much we are going to need here. I want to take Albania, I want to take the remaining provinces here. And probably also I want to annex Ham here. Therefore I take everything I can. No. Light looting in this case. It's going to fire be fine that they siege a bit here. Uh, let's simulate if we can take everything here we can but a lot of people will hate us for it fine there and we can make the claim on Venice in fact In fact, we could go only after uh, Serbian provinces here, like these ones. And then the other ones would break free. And then we can declare war on them afterwards at some point. Might be faster and less expensive. Come on. For you here. Is there anything going to happen to their vessels? Are they going to be transferred to me? Ownerships. Whew. I don't know. There's the CB against Venice. They're taking stuff from us. There we go. Now, if we were only to take this, they still hate us quite a lot for it. So maybe we just do something like this here. Wouldn't they always hate us? More or less. Hmm. In fact, let's make a path to the coast here and make peace. There we go. And we can call these three. And that's it. Now we got another harbor here, which is more important currently because it gives us easier access to the Balkans in case of rebellions. And we definitely need to let our war exhaustion decay here. Okay, I'm going to make a cut here and we are going to see each other in the next episode when we are finally looking into reforms. I promise. Therefore, see you next time.